found as I was looking for a red envelope for the ticket. Some old info stuff that I used to use when I did um, shows. A couple of prints. An info sheet. I really wish I had like some like gold ceiling stamp or something. I don't have anything like that. <laughs> this is the closest I could come to a luxury. So we're going to see Father Christmas today. Um, so I thought I'd print out his ticket and make it look as if his ticket has been delivered by Father Christmas. So. I'm hoping he's going to enjoy this. <laughs> I don't know if you can see, but there's a wren in the drain pipe. There he is. She is. Oh, she's done. It's now Monday. I've just packaged up some orders from the weekend. Thank you so much. Um, I'm really pleased with how well the mushroom bookmarks are selling. I put up a quantity of, I can't remember how many. I usually put quantities of like three on Etsy because um, something I was following said that if you do that, then it sells out quicker so then it boosts your listings or something but I put it on a higher listing number um, or in stock quantity than what I would do my other products and they all sold I had to renew it this morning so thanks <laughs> you're all really liking the mushroom bookmarks which I'm really really pleased about uh, yeah so today I need to work on my commission um, but I'm really kind of oh, I don't really want to <laughs> I'm still stuck in this mood of I want to do some redesign of the studio and I want to start designing all of the stuff that I want to bring out for the new year I've got my cricket out my cricket is down here but I don't want to even begin unboxing or playing with it until I've at least got part way through of this commission because I'll just get distracted and then I won't get it done in time and I don't want that to happen it's just going to be a little bit sorry I just yawned and then my eyes are really watery <laughs> this morning is going to be a little bit chill I don't have I was like had such a good weekend we did so much and it was so nice and then today I'm like my social button needs resetting I need to reset myself so I'm not very 
energetic this morning. I probably would be if I was working on some things that I wanted to do. Or as I'm just as I said, not really feeling working or even like drawing too much today. I've done a lot of drawing over the past two weeks. Pretty much non-stop like every day. And yeah, I just want to, I've really gotten back into the mood of editing videos and just creating content and just yeah i just want to create some stuff edit i want to take my new photography photos i can't today because it's like hella dark it's hello i know we're in winter now but this is ridiculous i don't like having to put my lights on because it means having to spend more electricity <laughs> but yeah so that's where we're at today um nothing really else to do apart from draw and try and get this done. Outline, I don't know if you can see it very well. The outline for the two Cairn Terriers is now done. <sighs> Yay! <laughs> so, um, I'm gonna move you guys up a little bit. Um, what I'm gonna do now is try and get a little bit drawn. Oh, I just, I mean, like such a f drawing funk today. I just, mm, mm -mm, do not want to. Do not want to draw. I'm doing everything that I possibly can to not draw. It's currently it's almost ten o'clock, so I've spent an hour and a half just packaging orders and doing the outline and everything. I do also have a watercolor that I need to do, which I could get done possibly. Um, also, I went to the range. This isn't very exciting, <laughs> but I went to the range at the weekend. And I picked up some of these uh, little plastic boxes. They're just the right size to fit in my drawers. And I've got like loads of washi tapes and things that are just, whenever I open my drawers, they fly to the back. So I thought I could get a couple of these boxes, pop them in my drawer, and they're also going to be used to house my bookmarks. Because I am going to get rid of that Calax unit and I'm going to replace it with just some Alex drawers and extend my work surface along so that I can put the Cricut on so we can start making sticker packs and things which I'm really really excited about and during the next few vlogs we're going to be making those and doing all of that. I need to make a list. I think that's what I'm going to do next <laughs> because I just need to get all of this stuff out of my mind. But I think I'm going to make a list of everything that I need that I need and want to do. So then it's out of my mind and then I can just go through the checklist and check everything off and get it done. But I was going to wait until like the 28th of December to go to IKEA. But oh, I don't know if I can wait that long. I don't know if I can, because if I wait until then, then that only gives me a couple of days until I reopen for January. And I don't want to have to like rush around doing the studio up. So I think I might see how much it is to get the drawers delivered. I know that might be expensive, but they might not fit in the car if we're taking James to Ikea anyway. So I'm going to see how much it is to get them delivered. And if it's not too much, then I think I'm just going to get them delivered. And then, yeah, then I can just put them up. Um, I need to sort, I've got um, a couple of boxes here that I was going to put out for recycling. But I think I'm going to fill them with my paperwork from 
the previous tax year which I haven't put away yet for some reason um, and there's also a bunch of folders that I no longer need out because I'm not printing out all my paperwork I'm just keeping it digitally rather just trying to save some paper and stuff so I don't need all of these folders down here so I'm going to clear out some of the folders and then I can put some of my packaging materials and other things down there and then slowly start to clear this Kallax unit here so this little cube unit here just houses like all of my bookmarks this has got my thank you notes and notepads and everything in it which I really need to try and sell because I just I need to get rid of them they just need to go so I'm thinking for this week I might try and put up like a little special offer of when you order you get a free notebook um, just so I can try just to get just to clear them because I don't want them in stock for the new year I want to make some new ones ready for the new year um, and <laughs> just going back to the Calyx unit there is just like this cube unit is for my scanner I can move my scanner no problem when I've got the new drawers and just put it on top of the new drawers there's no problem um, this unit over here this this one here has just got pens in it I've got loads of pots that I can put those pens in and just clear that out um, and then that the top ones is just paperwork and that's just my label maker uh, but I'm thinking of keeping this top cube unit because it's two I've got a box of eight cubes here and then I've put a two on top so I'm going to keep that two and put it on top of the Alex drawers but put it like upright if that makes sense and um, so then I've still got two cube units and then my cricket can live on the extended desk and so can my new printer when I get it so yeah I'm really excited about it so I'm gonna start to just clear some of those things out uh, this week I'll bring you along for the process um, so we can just really really get organized for the new year and just start fresh I've just got myself a mince pie and another cup of tea I'm gonna start drawing now but I have cleaned out one whole cube unit <laughs> yay <laughs> And I've also cleaned out um, like half of this one. I need some more boxes to put my uh, bookmarks in. The rest of them, the top ones, I need to sort out my paperwork and just put it in. So I've got like a pile of boxes over here. And half of these folders down here are empty. So I'm going to put some of these folders into a box along with some of the, the all of the paperwork from these folders down here because they're all last year's paperwork and then I'll have space on the bottom there so I'll put some of my packaging on the bookshelf over there I just am going to put everything that can fit into spaces so that I can move all of this stuff off and then once I get the new drawers I can then put stuff back into the drawers so I've got more Space on all of the other shelves and everything but I've also gone through some of my drawers down here so these Alex drawers here I don't know I'm in the way and I've used some of these baskets to like put my rolls of tape in um, I've also cleaned out this drawer and then I've used it to just put all of my I'm in the way sorry there's just not much room because of all these boxes and all this other stuff but I've put all of my pins and everything in there so there's still room in that drawer as well so I can put bookmarks and other things or just like art supplies or something in there but we're clearing out the Kallax unit but now it is it's 11 o'clock and I've got my mince pie and a cup of tea and I need to start drawing so I need to get at least like the eyes and the eyebrow bits done today and then I know that I'll be able to like finish off the rest tomorrow. I'm hoping to get this portrait done by Thursday so I can package it up and send it Friday so that it can be with the owner Monday. Even if I get it, even, even if I'm working on it for a little bit Friday morning, if I get it in the post Friday by 5pm to my local 
post office that's the word i'm looking for uh then it's all good so yeah i feel a little bit better that i've got some of the cleaning out process done so we're making a little bit of a headway with that it's also going to cost me 40 pound to get the alex drawers delivered and because they're quite wide i'm not sure because i'm going to have to take james with me to ikea i can't just like leave him at home um i'm gonna have to take him with me and i don't know if there's going to be enough room in the car because the boot in my car is quite small it definitely won't fit in the boot and his car seat is quite large that you can't fold the the seats down easily so i'm just wondering whether i just pay to get it delivered and i'll be here thursday and then i can rearrange the office and everything the following week because i'm actually stopping doing most things on friday um so yeah i'm thinking i might just get it get it delivered and then i can set it up during the week next week and we can move all of the furniture around <laughs> anyway also i'm going to be adding um to any orders placed on etsy just to get rid of the notebooks and stuff i'm going to be adding notebooks to any orders that are placed on the shop so you'll get a free notebook one of the little a6 ones i think um and then when they run out if they run out i'll start putting in the a5 ones so if you want to get yourself a card for three pound fifty and get a free notebook head on over to my etsy shop um yeah so i'm gonna call it quits for this studio vlog i hope you have enjoyed it I'm just kind of recording everything that I'm doing at the moment and putting it out as content just it's because, you know, you guys might enjoy it. You might find something of value in my busy mind and wanting to do stuff and then procrastinating about doing the stuff that I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you guys very, very soon.